Hey everyone, welcome to Judging for the Win. I'm Dave, and this is my daily ruling. Today's question was suggested by a viewer. Thanks to Travis Mahoney for this one. Amy is sacrificing Moon Silver Key, and she wants to get Forsaken Monument. Is this possible? Okay, so right out of the gate, we can see that Forsaken Monument is not a basic land card. It is an artifact, though, so the answer to this question really hinges on whether or not Forsaken Monument has a mana ability. So if we take a look at the card, we can see that it has three different abilities, but only one of these is a really promising candidate for being a mana ability. So the question then becomes, is the middle ability for Forsaken Monument a mana ability or not? And to answer this question, we're of course going to take a look at the comprehensive rules. First of all, let's notice that this ability in question uses the word whenever. That means that it is a triggered ability. Now, a triggered ability is considered to be a mana ability if it meets these criteria. We can see that there's no problem at all with the first and the third criteria. It definitely does not have a target, and it definitely could add mana to your mana pool as it resolves. So the third one is the only one that people might get a little bit hung up on. The wording on this ability doesn't match exactly what the wording on the comprehensive rule says that it needs to say. However, if we take a look at this other rule here, hopefully that should clear up any doubts that anybody else has. As you can see, this ability does indeed trigger from a mana ability or from mana being added to your mana pool. And so therefore, this does meet all of the criteria necessary to be a triggered mana ability. So this is indeed a legal play. You can get a Forsaken Monument with a Moonsilver Key because the middle ability of Forsaken Monument is a mana ability. When the designers of Moonsilver Key were writing this card, they probably were not thinking about triggered mana abilities, but that doesn't mean you shouldn't because this is one case where you definitely can get a card that has a triggered mana ability rather than a boring old normal activated mana ability, which is what all the people who don't like thinking outside the box are doing. And that's all I have for you today. How did you do? Join me again tomorrow for another daily ruling, but until then, I hope you have a great day.